Well, hello everyone on, in the Dundee land and also on adverts.ie. I'm uh, about to try and revamp my uh, uh, advert on Dundee that's been there for the last two months for the transport of motorbikes, uh, lawnmowers and quads. Um, so I'm just going to demonstrate, first of all, uh, the ease of putting a heavy-ish motorbike into this trailer. Um, it's not it's the Honda VFR 800. Not the lightest bike that was ever made. A uh, little bit top heavy. So a good candidate uh, to demonstrate um, uh, both loading and then uh, uh, tying down the bike in the trailer. Okay. So, just putting the bike up on the centre stand on a piece of plywood. Okay. So, there we have our VFR 800 now fully secured in the box on trailer. Uh, we have ties going onto the handlebars there. Uh, normally we would go inside at the tops of the forks but we can't in this case because the fairing is so high and wide we don't want the ties rubbing against the fairing okay so this bike obviously has a center stand so that makes the thing a lot easier if it didn't have a center stand um, we would have to tie in, in towards the forks which I did a few days ago with a BMW K13 1300 that had no center stand um, but there was it was just a totally different layout uh, without any any uh, ties against fairing okay so that is solid as a rock there now. Okay, so and um, this front tie is just purely to keep the just keep the steering solid. And I will let down so on the back the rear wheel of the bike is again the pallet and which the pallet is again the ramp the door ramp and i will let down the ramp now so you can see exactly how that's okay so here we are at the back so this is effectively our alternative to a, a front wheel uh in a chuck um we have two ties here pull ties on each side okay so we are pulling the pulling the bike back into the pallet uh, that will not go forward okay so the reason there's a cut out in the pallet uh, that was to accommodate uh, the BMW 1300 that I brought uh, this week obviously that has a, a much longer wheelbase and as from the photographs that I would that I put up you can see um, what we had to do um, I am very particular about having the bike in the middle of the trailer 
uh, to have it perfectly balanced. I do not like uh, weight uh, up front in, on any trailer. I like to have uh, about 10 to 20 kilos uh, downward weight on my hitch. Uh, so I always uh, keep the bikes back. If I was bringing two motorbikes, which I have done, I would put one up in the front of the trailer and the bigger, heavier bike would be in the back. And I would actually have the front of the bike uh, facing the front wheel would be actually up against the ramp, which I have done um, years ago uh, very successfully. Put the Honda, put the CBR 600 up front at a slight angle to one side and the VFR would be facing the the front of the VFR front wheel would be up again the uh, the rear up against the ramp uh, for a balance again so uh, so that's really about that's the that's kind of a, a new new method I have now for bringing a just bringing one bike in this trailer and of course <clears throat> you can see the length of that ramp it's very long uh, uh, it's not steep the floor is much lower than your typical Ford Transit or Renault Master um, so no steep inclines with ramps again the back of a van and the hazards that that poses so this is as safe as it can possibly be um, for for uh, getting the bike into the trailer and out again. Uh, just it just cannot be uh, more ideal uh, than that than the setup of that trailer.